Back, the Sherry Land School District is considering a $40 million bond that will provide upgrades to several aging facilities within the district. Local 23's Mike Jimenez tells us about those plans and how much it'll cost taxpayers. That's right. District officials say if voters approve that bond package, they will be making major improvements at three campuses plus a brand new headquarters for the district. Now, there are two propositions on the ballot. Proposition A for $34 million would include additions and renovation projects at Sherryland High School, Sherryland Advanced Academic Academy, to include the expansion of band halls and cafeterias, creating a college-like atmosphere for the campuses. And at John Sherry Elementary, the bond would be used for a new sixth grade wing and new library. Now, Proposition B is a $6 million bond to rebuild a brand new headquarters for the district. Officials say the original central administration building has been condemned by the city of Mission since 2016. This project here, this bond proposal, uh, will address, you know, of course, safety and security measures, 21st century learning spaces, instructional program capacity, and will also provide a collaborative space for innovative thinking for students while extending the life of the facility. Now, if approved, district officials say they believe and are confident based on financial forecasts and projections that taxes will not increase above the current tax rate of $1.29 per $100 of property value until 2025, then a maximum increase of three cents is expected. In the past two years, the district has been able to compress the tax rate down almost nine cents. Officials say that they are in a good financial position to move forward, adding it's an opportunity for taxpayers to be informed voters and determine if this is the right time as a community to move forward with the bond package. Now, for more information about the package, you can, of course, head on over to valleycentral.com. Putting local first in mission, I'm Mike Jimenez, 